Good morning, everyone, and welcome back. We are on the first day, as you can see, of the Ryko Research event. It's time to get started, and unfortunately, we had a little bit of an issue with the game yesterday that kind of messed up my entire plan that I set up yesterday. Uh, it kicked in pretty early for me, so it didn't work out too well with what I had planned and what I was trying to do, but we do have Ryko. It is here today. The, the event starts now. Yesterday was also the first day of Good Sleep Day, so today is the main day of Good Sleep Day, but let's go ahead and jump into it, grab our sleep points, and we'll figure out what we're going to do from here. We've got 600 sleep points, which puts us at 4,586, so we can buy another Master Ball if need be. And first things first, we, uh, let's grab our daily lottery. Biscuit. Ooh, ticket. That, that might help. That might help this week or next week. We'll just have to wait and see. But before we can really get into the Ryko event, let's go ahead and finish the week off. We got to get our weekly summary out of the way and our last sleep report. 240 with nine hours, 44 minutes of sleep. I was very, very sleepy yesterday. We've got 7% uh, dozing, 62% snoozing, and 31% slumbering. So that is looking good for the snoozing. Yes. Okay, so we do have a good chance of seeing an Eevee. Drowsy power 1.5. So that should put us, um, what's that going to be, like 40, 35 million, somewhere around there? Yeah, right at 40, 40 40.3 million. All right, mostly one stars, a couple of three stars, and, and in a top belly. So maybe some new stuff. New stuff would be very nice. Ooh, is that new? It is new. Okay, so we only need one other new one to go along with it. If we could get one other new one, that would be fantastic. I saw something in there that was interesting, though. So we have a Diglett, a Slowbro, a Pikachu, a Ditto, uh, an Eevee, which is good. That's what we want. And a Slowpoke. So that's six, which means we do have the two new sleep styles we need. And there's one, a Clefairy, a Top Belly. So that is, uh, is that all of them? That is, that was the last one we needed for Clefairy. And then don't do anything too fast because the game likes to freak out. It looks like the game's already kind of freaking out because I feel like that new shouldn't still be there. Ooh, running a bit chunky. Uh, let's see, there's Ditto. Um, where's this other new sleep style? Where are you? Mm, there it is. Oh, that's an interesting one. With the trail coming out, mid-dig sleep. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> and that might be the last one we need for Diglett, because I don't think, yeah, it doesn't have a four star. Probably haven't figured out how to put a Diglett on top of a Snorlax without murdering the Snorlax. All right, so we did get the two new sleep styles we need so we can increase our pot space before we make breakfast today. We Whoa, no, 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 Ooh, almost, almost, uh, almost goofed. Uh, no one's hungry, unfortunate, but we do want the Eevee, which has already been fed, so it doesn't matter. Pikachu has also already been fed, and Diglett, we fed a couple biscuits, but we're not going to today. Eevee's all we're here for. So we're gonna grab the Eevee. Take that home. Finally. Has this been the only one we've caught all week? I kind of feel like it's the only one we've seen all week. Maybe I'm just forgetting. <laughs> I mean, we saw one at some point to give it a biscuit to put it at three out of five, but I feel like I haven't seen one all week until today. We are going to send out the Pikachu candy because it is the only electric that we got to spawn due to the event. We're sending out electric candies. Hopefully that helps in some way. I'm still not sure if it does, but we did get 2,337 research XP, which is enough for a level up, which does give us a biscuit, two small dream clusters, and an energy pillow. And then 3,283 dream shards to go along with it, which we're about to put to good use as soon as we get back to camp. But let's check out this Eevee first, level 13 and quirky. Uh, so we've got milk, milk, and sausage, the default loadout. Um... 
actually not a bad loadout for the ingredients. That's not bad at all. Uh, research XP bonus up first. It's okay. Ingredient finder, not great. Helping speed, not good. Definitely not. Ah, berry finding at level 100, really? Inventory S and berry finding. Uh, also quirky, which is neutral. So not great. Not great at all. Definitely not what we want to see, especially for a Jolteon candidate. We want that berry finding where research XP bonus was. If those two were flipped, this wouldn't be terrible. This could be a good interim Jolteon. But uh, yeah, as it stands now, not great. So this one is uh, going to the professor. So good job, you. Well, at least we caught one. At least we got to see one. And we got to figure out if it was actually going to be any good. That just means the next one will be better. But now we can go ahead and move on to the next research site. Which we all know where we're going. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. The 45% on the island. Apparently, I forgot to update it. Still showing 40 or 35% from last time. So no wonder my calculations were off. All right. Say goodbye to the Snorlax and let's go ahead and move on. Weekly summary for week 35. Master 1. Everything is down. I'm not even going to talk about it because we knew it was going to be down. We were taking a chill week. I had an overall grade of A probably thanks to yesterday and the day before. Go me. It is good for four uh, small handy candies though. So still good. Ooh. Rise and shine. I've got a special research request for you today. Oh, this is new. Oh, okay, what we got? I've received reports of repeated peals of thunder over Greengrass Isle. I did some follow-up research. Oh, you talk so slow. I did some follow-up research in the area and found bits of Raikou Mane left behind by the legendary Pokemon Raikou. I'd like to analyze some of the Raikou Mane to learn more about Raikou's ecology. So I'd like you to collect samples of Raikou main for me during your sleep research. If I get a bit more Raikou main, I should be able to create some Raikou incense. If you use that, I'm sure you'll be able to encounter Raikou during your sleep research. So let's work hard together on our Raikou research. Okay. I mean, that was cool. It was a little something. It was kind of nice to see something different. Kind of hope they do more of that, but they definitely need to speed up that text because that was super slow. <laughs> so we are going to Greengrass Isle, of course. It's the only place where the event is happening. Ooh, the little crackles of electricity all over the place, it's desserts and drinks. And we've got, oh, that might be super good. Greppa, what is that? Is that Bluck Berries? Which berries are those? It's not the wiki berries, which is dark type. Good. Yeah, it's the bluck berries for the ghost type. Ooh. Mmm, that could be really good. And then the chesto berries for poison. That's also good. That's uh, toxic rock for the oil and pick up the chesto berries along with it for the popcorn. And then, uh, man, the only thing that would make it better is if instead of bluck, that was uh, cherry berries or the yachi berries for the corn, for the popcorn. Ooh. That's good though. I think that's a pretty decent lineup of berries. I don't know that I want to, I don't think I want to use an easy travel ticket to switch and try to get different berries. I think those are pretty good. Um, for desserts, popcorn. Yeah, we could do the popcorn pretty, Oh yeah, orange berries would be good too because we'd need the milk from Blastoise, so that'd be good too. Mmm. That's pretty good. I'm gonna go ahead and move on. I might use an easy travel ticket. Let me see. Maybe we want curry anyway. We did get the double XP from the good sleep day event. So that is also nice. 58,992 sneaky snacking. I believe that is a record for our sneaky snacking. 37,944 from Raichu alone. And who was not on this list? Who else did we have? Ampharos? Ampharos was not on this list. That's weird. 38,000 sneaky snacking alone from Raichu. 
That's very good. I think that puts us... That might even put us a great one already. Great four. Woo! Yep, okay. Um, so we're doing... We're doing okay. You know. Could be worse. Alright, so we are already great four. Uh, tonight we have drowsy power times four because it's on a Monday. But before I do anything and forget, the pot is what I want to do. We want to increase. Uh, oh, yeah, I've got to collect it first. Uh, gold met, 290, sleep styles, which gives us 100 diamonds, one sub skill seed, and one medium handy candy. Ooh, very good. 290. Everything is looking very, very good today. Today is a good day. Good start to the Raikou event. Well, look at this. Great job. You've now registered 290 sleep styles in the sleep decks. I think a hard worker like you deserves a sub skill seed. You are not incorrect, good sir. You've probably noticed by now that each of your Pokemon has special abilities called sub skills. Are you going to tell us what we all know that with a sub skill seed, you can improve the quality of one of your Pokemon's sub skills at random? Improving the quality of a sub-skill will cause a sudden jump in the effect it can have. Here, something to help as you work towards future sleep style dex goals. I'll get back to setting up another new area while you do that. Keep up the good work on the sleep research. So the next goal, uh, yep, nothing new to work towards now. So all of the new sleep styles we get will just be helping whenever the new goals are released, which will probably have another island to go along with it. Oh, that's expensive. Okay, so we're going to have to use a lot. A lot of Dream Shard. Uh, dream Clusters. First, we have new news for the performance issues fix. I'm sure you all ran into this. I did too, like I said earlier. It messed with my ability to collect the berries from Dedenne and Arcanine. So they couldn't try to get a skill trigger. We ended up, before the bug kicked in, we ended up only getting one each, so unfortunate, but uh, also funny, because that one that triggered on Arcanine triggered the extra help for Ampharos, and yet that one, Ampharos wasn't on the sneaky snacking, so not sure there. Uh, the game is currently experiencing the following performance issue. Let's address it and figure out what it is. A bug that caused error 25200, which is what I had, to occur and return to the title screen when Snorlax ate berries. Yep. Snorlax's strength and rating gain animations playing on a loop in certain situations. That didn't happen to me. This bug can be removed by tapping the menu button on the title screen and then tapping clear cache if it happens. Cool. Uh, fixed the bugs resolved as of version 1.0.12. Um, oh. These are old. These are old bug fixes. Mm, okay, so this just seems like a running log of everything because these are all bugs that they fixed back in the day, back in November, October, and September. Yeah, so these this is just a running log of things that have been fixed and known issues. So it says as of 9.30 p.m., they fixed the bugs, but I definitely was having that issue after 9.30 p.m. So maybe I'm just misreading this. Maybe they're talking about all this below has been fixed. But yeah, I was running into error 25200, so I don't know. I mean, that means they're working on it. And with as game breaking as it is, it should be a high priority. So that's good. But back to the problem. Uh, if it's going to cost 86,000 Dream Shards to level up the pot once, and we want to level it up twice, how many Dream Clusters are we going to have to use? Um, I'm going to have to do math, just because they made it fun. And honestly, if we don't have curries, we don't need the pot size increase just yet. Oh, not curries, desserts. Yeah, if we have desserts, we don't need the pot size increase just yet. Because even if we had it and could make Jigglypuff's Fruity Flan, which is 55 ingredients, we don't have the ingredient gatherers to make it consistently. So that's still only a Sunday thing for me. But let's see. Uh, 1,778 Dream Shards per cluster. 
and we have 68 of them. That only gives us 120 plus another 44,000 from the mediums. We still, we would maybe have exactly enough to get the pot as to its max capacity, but I don't know. Honestly, with how this week is gonna go already and the fact that we're on green grass, I don't know that it's a high priority to spend all of our dream clusters right now just to get it. I think we just let our dream shards build back up naturally and go from there, honestly. But we do have a main menu item. It is a gift. What did we get? Oh, a special gift. What is this? What is this? You couldn't claim these gifts because you don't have room. Wow. Okay. Well, back it up again. All right, let's see. Why don't I have room? Uh, 201 out of 200. Oh, uh, okay. Well, I guess it's that time. General store. Let's scroll down. We have 975 diamonds, which means it is time to expand our item pocket. Oop, we're just expanding that one as we need to not in a rush to have it maxed out immediately when most of that space would remain empty all the time anyway. But let's claim our gift now. Let's see what it is. It, one Ryko biscuit. So seems like everybody's getting a free Ryko biscuit, which is also fantastic. And then for the community reports, kind of doing things a little out of order today, but that's all right. Only 45 reports with one, two. Oh, why can't I scroll? Um, that's weird. Okay, well, I can't scroll today. Oh, we got nine Ryko mains. Uh, three of them each from all level five friends. So that's really good. That's a good start. So if we can get more of those to trigger per day, we'll, we'll kind of see what the average is over the next few days. But three is a good start. Jeffer, there we go. Another level five just in time for the event with a small handy candy. Two of them. There we go. The more level fives we have, the better because that's more Ryko mains in our pockets. All right. Now let's collect everything. No, first things first. Um, I think, let me see. How many good camp tickets do I have? Um... Will you tell me from here or do I need to go and look? I thought I thought it told you from this menu. Well, let's go look at the bag. I want to know how many I have. Um, I have one. Yeah, yeah, we can use one. I'm not worried about using one right now. We'll we'll get it back. OK, so we're going to use a good camp ticket. Use it. And we're going to see, we might hit, we might get lucky and hit master 20 this week. There is another skill trigger from Dedene. That's good. So seems like things are working well. Don't crash. Don't give me error code 25200. Looks like we're good. Um, uh, Arcanine skill trigger on skills 53, which is unfortunately Dedene. So, not who we wanted, but it all adds up. And then we've got some more berries from you, some more berries and apples from you, and no skill trigger on either of them, which is unfortunate, and no skill trigger for Ampharos either. Unfortunate. Um, well, that's great, but let's go ahead and make breakfast. I think we're gonna be doing all right. I think desserts are a very, very nice thing. Already completed, gives Snorlax 354 of its favorite berries. We have what we need for the explosion popcorn. How are we looking on corn? We definitely need to get a corn gatherer on the team immediately. Oil, definitely gonna to have Toxic Croak on the team. Milk, mmm. We may be okay on milk if we just run Espeon on the team, and I think that's a solid call this week. Uh, we do have 77 space, er, uh, ingredients. Pot size, that's it, that's the word. Could not think of it, brain was just being real dumb. <laughs> 
We're gonna have some very chocolatey, hopefully caramelly, caramelly, caramel, caramelly, whatever. Caramel corn. 21,594 caramel corn. All right, so that's gonna give us level 19. Very good. Things are looking good this week. Things are looking very good this week. So far, so good. And that will put us at, let's see, we already hit grade four. So maybe, maybe ultra two if we're lucky. Probably not though. Ultra one, almost ultra two. So not bad. We still have a long way to go to master 20, but I kind of want to try. I kind of want to try just to see if we can. We do have the second sleep style for Raikou that unlocks at master 19. So there is a reason to get there. Plus, we're going to have a lot of insane, hopefully new rare spawns if we get to that point. Um, for now, until we get a Raikou, I think we have, I think we know exactly what we do with the team. So for this team, um, we didn't get extra tasty, so we could keep Dedene on the team just to keep trying to stock up extra tasties until it happens and then swap them out. But currently we have an 18% chance in total. So I'm, I think we're all right. We're definitely going to keep Raichu on the team. I think Ampharos is going to day for now we're gonna swap out arcanine he's a good boy but he was only on the team for yesterday to try to stock up those skill triggers and unfortunately that didn't work thanks to the error uh where are you where, there you are espion i think is a solid choice on the team uh we can get those skill triggers which each of them are worth uh what is that 1726 normally but it's actually going to be worth a bit more with the bonus, another 55%. Um, let's let's see. We need Toxicroak on the team for sure. So let's swap out Halloween Pikachu for Toxicroak. Uh, there you are, bud. Hopefully you don't get to level 30 because that would ruin my oil production. Uh, use. I don't know. We might need to give him an energy pillow, but he may be okay. Let's see. Uh, and then we need... I'm hoping that Espeon can give us the 21 milk we need, or at least keep our supply high enough that we don't run out too quickly. If need be, we swap in Blastoise for a day or something like that and get some extra milk. Uh, we do need corn on the team. And I don't think Dedene's skill is helping too much if we got two triggers a day it's only an extra eight percent it does add up but eventually i am going to swap them out anyway so i don't think it's really super necessary in the meantime i think we put we put you on the team just to try to bring that corn in and then we could Ampharos is good, but I think, honestly, bringing in our Barry Gengar might be better. Let me see. Let's go ahead and sort by the favorite berries, and let's see what we're looking at. Maybe we have somebody that's better that I'm just not thinking of. Uh, ooh, we could. This could be the time for us to use our, our Shuppet, actually. Would also bring in some extra oil every now and then, helping speed inventory up. Uh, main skill chance. Eh, actually, no, I probably would never collect. And we have a decent amount of candies to do something with it. Maybe? Maybe this is the time. I mean, we are going to get a mul an XP multiplier from tonight, so we'd get a decent amount of XP on it. Um, the question is... Which, let's go find out. The question is, what does the rating on this thing look like now that things have changed? Because I don't think I've rated this since we first caught it. So let's see what its current rating is under the new models. Uh, let's go ahead and run up to... Let's run up to 100 because it does update in real time as it goes. 
So maybe we can get a better idea of how good this is. 73 is so far better than what it originally was predicted. I think the problem is the nature. Yeah, the nature doesn't give us speed of help up, which we do want. But we do have helping speed in. Uh, so it looks like it might be around the same. Currently 71, it is a little bit better than originally predicted. And it might be worth investing in in the short term. But... I'm thinking I just need to do a little bit more research into this. I probably need to go and compare the Gengar we have currently with what I can turn that Shuppet into first. So I think, and let me just double check one last time, make sure there weren't any other favorite berry gatherers that I was skipping over. Um, no. Everybody else is, uh, well, Ekans, not as good as the Shuppet. Probably use the Shuppet over the Ekans. Everybody else is ingredient or skill specialist. We could do the Pikachu, honestly. I also need to compare them. I'll compare Gengar to Pikachu to Shuppet, the Halloween Pikachu, and we'll see which one, I'll see which one comes out to be the better choice and then I will switch the team to that but for now this is what we're gonna run with it looks like it's not gonna finish the calculation which is expected I do know that uh, we still don't have the uh, drowsy power requirements figured out for Raiko I w so well for anybody so trying to get to master 20 I think is just a good call in general no one has any berries, but we can do lunch. We could probably do another popcorn. Yes. So let's go ahead and do another popcorn. We will load it down with potatoes. Um, sausage, honestly. We don't need all this sausage. And that should give us a pretty good boost. Definitely put us into Ultra 2, which we were already there anyway. If we get an extra tasty, which we didn't, uh, it's 19,371, so about 2,000 shy compared to using all the cocoa. But that also puts it at level 20. All right. So, things are looking really good for us. Level 20 officially puts it above the Lovely Kiss smoothie. All right, officially Ultra 2. And we are just at the start of Monday. Okay, so that's the team we're gonna run with. We're gonna check out the exchange, the event exchange, which is up here in the top right. Um, we only have nine mains, so we can't buy anything. But everything is looking pretty, pretty solid. Um, I think that we are not gonna have any issues with all of this. We should be very, very well equipped to buy pretty much everything that we want. I don't think we're gonna have any issues. I really just wanted to clear that big event exchange uh, splash thing out of my face. But let's collect our mission result rewards. We are gonna get 15 mains from getting to basic two, another 15, 25 from getting to ultra one. We're almost to ultra four already. Did we make it to ultra three? Is that what that's saying? That's kind of what it looks like. Uh, we haven't done the biscuits yet, but we did also get two of our weekly missions. We got some dream shards, which we of course desperately need. And we got another three small handy candies which will also help. Uh, we get a Chikorita incense this week, which is good. We do need another Chikorita and we have a potential for some more diamonds, which we also need. Um, the last thing that we need to do for today to just kind of see how the week is gonna go. Now that we've got the team together, let's go ahead and check with the analysis and see how they're gonna work out. So we've got Raichu on the team already. Uh, this is the 50% Gengar, which is, which one is this? It is the Mushroom Oil, so it's that one. 
Dragonair. Uh, you are this Dragonair. Then Toxicroak, which is lower on the list. Almost to the end. There you are. And Espeon, which is... Where's Espeon? There you are. Okay. Espeon is level 28. Uh, Toxicroak is 27. And Dragonair is 30. That's a big jump. Gengar is still 33, and Raichu is now 36. All right, so last thing, map bonus is 55%. Uh, we are on green grass. So, oh, no, we don't set that there. We set that here, green grass, and we have Grappa berries. We have, I don't even remember what these are called, Chesto berries and Bluck Berries. Okay. We're gonna leave your pack full and maybe we might leave his pack full. What does that do? 21,000 up to 12,000. Well, that's a bit skewed because it is basing it also off of his ingredients. We'll leave it as is for now. If we throw in all these extra mushrooms we get into the popcorn, we should get a pretty decent popcorn. But currently, oh, the one thing I did forget to do, hold on. We have a good camp ticket. Cool. So with a good camp ticket, only master 12, interesting. I have a feeling we're gonna get a lot higher than that since we're already, uh, already ultra four, three, somewhere around there, not four. Definitely not four. We would have got that mission. Ultra three. Yeah, ultra three. Almost halfway to four. Okay, well, we may even be master by the end of the night. I have a pretty good feeling about being master by the end of tonight, which means we're going to have a pretty solid research first thing in the morning. Trying to make sure I'm not missing anything else. I've selected this. I've selected the berries. Uh, we are showing that we're making popcorn which is level 20. Yeah, everything looks in place. We should be doing all right. Master 12. Um, I'm trying for master 20, at least 19, just to get the uh, second sleep style from Raiko. But uh, along the way, hopefully pick up some new sleep styles. Yeah, it's gonna be a good time. We had a fantastic start to the week. Uh, the only thing that would have made it better would be an extra tasty, but hey, can't complain about it. It seems like everything is going well. The bug that we, a lot of us ran into, they're fixing it. So hopefully that will be fixed soon. If it isn't already, I didn't have any issues, but maybe it's just a, sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't kind of thing. Hopefully it's fixed soon. If not already, by the time this video comes out and yeah, we're gonna have a good time. Hopefully the, your Ryko event has started as well as mine. Let me know in the comments how things are going, what you're expected to hit this week, if you're gonna be shooting for Master 19 or if you're just gonna be going for Master 9. And hopefully things go well for you. That said, that is all I've got. Make sure to have a wonderful day. And until next time, later dudes.